attention, ladies. Are you looking for a six-foot silver fox who's ready to trade in his bachelor status and settle down? Well, Aaron Hughes has created a website and forked out nearly six grand on a magazine ad for his best mate, Graham, in an attempt to find him some love. They join us now in Melbourne. Good yes. morning, guys. There you go. I love it. <laughs> Wow, I mean, Aaron, this is a real commitment to the cause. Tell us how it all started. Um, my wife and I love dating shows and we were watching this one in particular called Millionaire Matchmaker and I turned to her and I said, we should do this for Babs. And uh, she she was like, how, how are you going to do this for him? And I said, I've got a few ideas and and, and here we are. And how wow. did you feel about Graeme? Yeah, look, I uh, I trust Aaron. He's, he's, my, he's my best mate. I've known him for 15 years and... If you hang around with him long enough, you get to uh, experience some of these crazy ideas. So, uh, <laughs> look, I know he had my best intentions, and then he, he built a website, and I thought, okay, he's, he's pretty serious about this. It, it looks just a bit of an extension of a dating profile, so that's okay. <laughs> and then on, on Thursday, I became aware that he'd, he'd taken out an ad in Marie Claire, so that, uh, that was a bit of a surprise. That was yeah. a bit of a surprise, but yeah, yeah. as I say, I, I know he's got my best intentions, so yeah. <laughs> And he's got quite the list. I mean, Aaron, the website asks questions like, have you ever been unfaithful and why do you think you're not in a relationship? <laughs> <laughs> People can even upload a resume. Have you had many applications? I'm curious. Um, the magazine's only been out since Thursday, I think, yeah. and we, we have had a few. There's already really? one really uh, potential, good potential match. Oh, so, really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's going well. Um, and, Graeme, do you get to have any choice in this? Because it doesn't seem like you're running any part of no, your own No, no, not at all. I've, I've given full <laughs> full control over to have Aaron you? and Aaron, his wife. Uh, I trust them completely. They, uh, you, know, you know, you need to try these, try new things when, uh, when it gets to a certain point, I think. Is it because you've made poor choices in the past? Oh, yeah. Well, look, okay. I, I'm not going to comment on that, but uh, I'll just say that I'm single at 40, so, so here we are. Yeah. You're not old, though. I mean, um, and yeah. what do you think of this potential partner? Yeah, look, uh, as I say, I, I trust Darren and Aaron's judgment. So uh, he's ready. He's ready. I'll, I'll let them run the process, and oh. uh, yeah, hopefully, uh, hopefully, we find find the right one. Why do you <laughs> think it's gone so catastrophically wrong for you in the past? <laughs> Is it I you? Think just, uh, like I think, a lot, I like think... a lot of people in, in in life these days, I think you you prioritise different things earlier in life, and and you get to a point and. Some people leave it a bit later than others and, and it, it gets a bit more difficult as you get older. So. All right, and, and, and we'll give you 15 seconds to sell yourself on national TV. Very good. <laughs> yeah, off you go. All right, look, I've got a great life. I've, uh, I'm fit, I'm healthy, I'm relatively sane. Uh, I've got great <laughs> friends, great friends. Uh, I'm clearly open to new experiences. And the only thing that's missing is a, is a romantic partner to share Aww. it with. So, so hopefully I can, I can find the right one. <laughs> He's gonna, super generous as well. We're just going to bring our finance expert, Effie Zahos, in here. Um, <laughs> Effie, Effie would, would you, do you have any advice? I actually like his mate. Oh! Uh, <laughs> his mate's mate, Effie! Oh, He's mate. <laughs> I'm married too! Wow! <laughs> oh, no, I well, <laughs> I'm just saying that maybe the tension might direct to both of them. Uh, what? <laughs> We've been wingman for a very, very long time oh, yeah. before wingman. I got married. I, so. I lost my wingman when he got married. Oh, so. yes. So I'm trying to so overcome he's, he's it. He's doing his best. He's doing I love his best it. I love it. All right. Anything more, Effie, to add? No. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, guys. We appreciate it. Best of luck. Thanks right. for having us. Yeah. No, Have a good day. Thank you. Oh, Jeez, you are a constant surprise. <laughs> Hey there, Today fans, Sarah and... <laughs> What's my name again? Oh my goodness, Carl. <laughs> hey, thanks for watching our YouTube <laughs> channel, though. Subscribe now for more news, special reports and amazing Aussie stories. And Carl misbehaving, Whoa, of course. That never happens. Always happens. What's she talking about?